Our base! Go, go, go! Hello, Warwick Troopers. We have some new updates on Warwick and they are really cool. Uh, the first update is new zombie map, Day 1. Day 1 takes you back to your beloved street of Marion. Just this time, zombies are on every corner of the map. There's also a new zombie that can jump and has claw knives. Second update is a new Veronica costume. Veronica is a top class female sniper. The enemies know to hide as soon as they hear her name. Nothing is known about this mysterious woman. No country of origin, not what she did before. All that is known is that she is heading straight for the battlefield. There are also four new weapon packages. The first one is the assault package. The package brings you the following weapons. The AK-47 tube, extra ammo and a compressed bandage. The second package is the heavy trooper package. In this package is a new kind of stinger, the T-bomb and the heavy trooper ammo box. There is also an engineer and medic package with a G36C drum, dual scorpions, medic boxes and an extra ammo clip. The last package is the sniper package. The package brings you the SR-25 sniper rifle, the T-bomb, a compressed bandage and an extra ammo clip. Nexon has also introduced new costume packages. The following packages are new. The breach package, the surgeon package, the GD suit package, the warrior package and the desert ops package. Nexon did also a security update. The hack shield has been updated to offer better protection against hackers. There is also a new zombie count event. Every time you kill a class zombie you get one count. When you leave the game your count stays. You can win 5 weapons until 300 counts. You can also collect ladders. Every time you play in day 1 you get one ladder of the word day 1. When you got all the ladders you will receive the micro uzi for 3 days. This was my 8th update video, I hope you liked it and on August 22 we get new work updates and I see you next time.